in the right place. KRC is a professional real estate consultant. Uh, what we do here is to what we do here is to help you become a professional real estate consultant and transform your life. That is the truth. What we do here is to transform your life. We help every person here achieve the lifestyle of their dream as a real estate consultant. So you undergo training with us and you get a certification and you now consider, um, begin a journey of financial freedom, helping other people achieve their real estate goals, helping other people achieve their real estate goals. So today we'll be looking into um, product knowledge, understanding the products in the real estate space and how you can plug in and help other people understand the real estate space and how they can invest into real estate. So as a consultant, your job basically is helping people make the right decisions in the real estate space. And that is what we'll be looking at today. All the um, uh, products within the real estate space will be exposed to them. Feel free to ask questions because the facilitator today is someone who have uh, um, many years experience in the real estate space. So feel free to ask questions. If you have friends that you feel you want to help, right? You can send the link right now to them, let them join so that they will understand what we are doing here and join and then join this journey with you together, right? There's somebody who came to me um, during the weekend, that was on Friday, and he was he was asking for an assistant. And I just told the person, look, see, if I give you 2,000 naira or 5,000 or 50,000 naira, that will not solve your problem. But come and join PRC. That will solve your problem for life. And she's here today. I, I, I believe she's here already. So you can just take her time now, send that link to a friend, to a family member to join because this is a life transforming program. It's a life transforming program. Many people are here who can testify to that. That has ever been ever since they joined PRC, get the certification. Those who have been certified, or those who are already selling and consulting within the real estate space, they can testify how that decision and journey has transformed their life. So, if today is your first time here, I want to assure you, you are actually in the right place and you are actually taking the right decision. You are taking the right decision. The real estate is one of the a vehicle that can transform your life in a short time within a short time it can transform your financial life within a short time and the best part of it is that you are actually helping people helping family helping organization achieve their real estate goals achieve their financial goals that's what you're actually doing right why in turn your own financial goals and lifestyle goals will be achieved so you're actually in the right place welcome to um today's edition uh without much i want to welcome our coordinator to take over from here why the facilitator will come right away thank you very much welcome to to this edition of prc thank you very much all right um thank you mr stanley Uh, thank you, Mr. Stanley. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you now. All right, all right, all right. Thank you so much. Um, well, before we go ahead with the product um, training, I'd like to first welcome everyone who is new today. Uh, you're welcome to PRC Global Academy. What we do at PRC Global Academy is to um, train you, certify you, and teach you how to earn. That's basically what we do. I understand that most of you um, are familiar with the word wealthers. But we use the word consultants because we'll try to um, make um, realtors become consultants. What do I mean by that? You don't just um, sell for the sake of getting commission or for the sake of earning from customers. But you sell because you want to provide solutions to customers and you want to be with a long time relationship with customers such that whenever um, anybody, any um, real estate investor wants to make a decision, they think of you first. So that's basically what we try to um make you see and position yourself in that aspect so prc is actually a partnership with asset rise where we um, give you opportunity to sell um, real estate and earn from whatever you sell so we are not just after you selling but we are also trying to provide 
um, job opportunity for a lot of um, realtors out there to earn from real estate and not just anyhow real estate, but um, a verified real estate um, company, which asset rights is. So um, we have Mr. Um, Sebastian the house who would actually be taking us uh, in-depth knowledge of asset rights products that you could actually understand and sell from. So after him, we will also um, talk about the Las Rera because I understand that most of you also are aware of the Las Rera, which is one of our licenses that we give to our consultants as they sell for asset rights. So we have Mr. Sebastian in the house. Mr. Sebastian, are you here? Hello, Mr. Sebastian, are you here? Good evening, here? everybody. All right, you're welcome, welcome, sir. Good evening. All right, Mr. Sebastian, you have the floor. You're welcome, Good sir. Good evening, everybody. You're welcome. Um, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, okay. we can hear you. Yes, good evening, everybody, and um, happy weekend. Happy Sunday to everyone. I, I hope we're having a rested weekend, and um um, positive that um, we are fine and our families are fine. We uh, want to especially appreciate everybody who um, made it out to um, attend this um, webinar. Thank you. I want to join every other person who has spoken to appreciate you for your time. Um, Assets Rise is a real estate company that is um, um, anchored on redefining real estate, redefining the terms of real estate as we know it to be. Um, I've always said that most times we try to use the same um, solutions to solve diverse problems or the same methods, the same methodology to solve diverse problems. And that is where we usually get it wrong, both as an individual and as a people. I'll give you an instance. Um, there was a time where chloroquine as a drug was the effective drug for the cure of malaria. And for many years, from 1905, it was the drug for cure. But it got to the year 2005 and medical experts found out that chloroquine was no longer um you know efficient in solving or in curing malaria and so something else needed to be done why was it no longer efficient because the malaria parasites became resistant to chloroquine and so that was when atimenta and was um what's it called was um was introduced so same for us in the real estate space you know we can no longer go on with the definition that has shaped real estate before today and asset rise is one company that is consciously pioneering the new definition of real estate and real estate as we should know it to be with this in mind we've been able to define that real estate is a tool that can be transactional transitional and transgenerational uh, what do i mean real estate is bigger than just you know buying the land building a house in fact it's even bigger than just buying the land and leaving it to mature over time to appreciate over time real estate yes it's a, it encompasses all of that but it is much more and it offers much more and in asset rise we are we are, we, are, we are banked on you know ensuring that we explore the entire value chain we explore the entire value chain again i want to appreciate everyone who's here who was able to make it to our launch of a 3000 hectares palm rich um estates out there in adodo in adodo in Ogun state um i believe a lot of us must have seen the um video if, if you did not catch up with the news at tvc um the videos are available online you can watch it and uh, you know you know share to our friends and family so today i'm going to be talking about some of our products which you know we've designed specifically to answer our real estate needs both as, as individuals and as organizations to ensure that we use real estate to explore the full potential of real estate let me give you an instance let's say you have something you have something of worth and it's worth let's say a million dollars but to you you are only using it for um for exchange for an article that is worth only a hundred naira, you have gotten the value of hundred naira, but you have just traded something that's worth much more. That's what real estate is. So we've been underutilizing real estate, and real estate can offer so much more. Our palm rich project, our palm rich model is one that, you know, tick a lot of boxes, ticks the boxes. We want to talk about, you know, um, sustainable plan, talking about sustainable passive income talking about your retirement plan, talking about, you know, everything, talking about financial stability, talking about food security and all of that. And with this project, what it does is that it tells you that buy a land in from palm trees. 
we already know the value chain of palm trees. We know the demand of oil palm. We know the numerous byproducts you can get from the oil palm tree. Your palm oil, your palm kernel oil, your black soap, your oil cake, you know, all of all that are things you can get from, you know, the palm tree. And we're saying that just the way a man will buy a house, buy a land for 10 million or for 5 million and spend another 10 million or 15 million to build on that land, you can buy hectares, you can buy hectares of land. You can buy hectares of land for that same amount of money and get more in rental income from oil palm trees. What have you done? It means you've not just acquired more land, more real estate, or expanded your real estate portfolio, but you have, you know, ensured you opened up a revenue stream, a revenue channel that is more secured and is, you know, it, it, it has more financial stability and security compared to, you know, the real estate, the buildings as you know it to be. And what happens is that you just, when you acquire a, a palm rich land, when you acquire land in the palm rich estates, you're not just acquiring the bare land. And you're not um, worrying yourself about planting the trees or maintaining the trees. Asset Rise ensures that those trees are planted on your land. So when you are buying the land, you're buying a land with trees on it. And while you are doing that, you have ensured you have made an informed decision. An informed decision that secures your future and the future of your generations to come. Because these trees, you can Google this, it is public knowledge, it's available on public domain can fruit for as long as 50 years imagine making a decision today or helping somebody make a decision today that will secure his generation that is somebody who would never forget you who would ensure that they can continue to be indebted to you for that particular advice which means that in your hands in your mouth on your lips you have the solution you have a value to give to everyone you come across every day it means everybody you come across you owe them a solution and if you are not giving them this solution it means you're selfish it means you are depriving them of something that can change their lives and we need to understand that this model you, uh, those of us who were at the launch of the 3000 hectares or who have seen the footage on tvc and other news platforms the, the mdc of ag mortgage bank was available and he was full of praise and full of you know um joy in partnering with asset rise and we have a lot of partners on this project with Papa, oil palm plc and ag mortgage bank who have thrown themselves at the project and are open to offering mortgage to people who are ready to buy um, um palm rich estates yes 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 you're hearing it for the first time here ag mortgage bank is designing something special for everyone who is looking at buying from the palm rich estates to provide you mortgage to purchase your property so ag mortgage bank i repeat can provide you a uh, mortgage to buy um, palm rich estates and you continue your mortgage plan secure your future and the future of your family so spread the news tell people that you can actually acquire properties from asset rise um, from the palm rich estates backed fully by ag mortgage bank who provide them mortgage to buy um the properties and um palm rich estates also does not just offer you the lands on the or the trees on the land it also offers you, you know, the service to help you cultivate those palm trees. And also, when these trees start fruiting, you need not worry yourself about, you know, how you're going to manage the sales, how you're going to manage the, the, the harvesting, how you're going to manage the milling and all of that. We also offer all of those services, which means that you can just sit at the comfort of your home while your land is appreciating in value in exponential figures you are earning from oil palm tree. It sounds so good to be true, but it is true. And it is one that we've experimented, we've practiced, and it is already in existence. Those of us who are familiar with the um, stock exchange market, you will understand that Okichwa Oil Palm PLC, Prevsco, and um, Okomu Oil, you can check the figures, you can check their, their, their numbers on the stock on the floor of the stock exchange. This is what you are coming into. You are making the same decisions people made five years ago, ten years ago, and they are living in financial stability today. This is a window for you to make that same decision now to secure your future and to ensure you help other people secure their future also. And the Palm Ridge Estate model is one that's not going to be available forever. It is the right time to key in and we have the very right products. For 495000 you can acquire a plot. Yes, you heard me. 495,000 you can acquire a plot of palm rich imagine using just 15 million or using less 7 million rather sorry with 7.5 million maximum you're acquiring 15 plots a hectare 
of palm rich estates and that can give you the financial stability that you can think of going forward uh the palm rich estate also is not our only um product we have residential estates which we're selling another thing i need to drop i need to add when you buy 15 plots of um palm rich estate which is one hectare so for those of us who are new to real estate 15 plots of land equals one hectare six plots of land equals one acre so when you are making a real estate decision ensure you are thinking about the acre and hectare subscriptions because these are the you know the kind of decisions that will help you tomorrow so for example even when you are buying a residential property buy think of plan to buy an acre or an hectare let me tell you why when you buy at these cheap prices now tomorrow when you want to sell when you want to develop rather you can sell your extra plots and use the money to develop where you want to develop so indirectly you've made a marvelous you've made an informed decision years before that you'll be proud of in future also like i said we have residential estates um in um, lagos and Ogun states um mind you when you buy an, uh, an hectare of palm ridge estates adodo you get a free plot at motherland smart city adodo phase two that package it's limited offer available limited plots available so we should run and ensure that we get all of that sealed out imagine you're buying 15 plots you're buying just one hectare of palm rich and you're getting a free plot of a residential estate in motherland smart city in the motherland estate this is just wonderful it means you can have a home close to your oil palm tree farm and it is a dream come true it is perfect romantic dream is a perfect successful dream a successful life and it is just fabulous and this um um, um you know is also limited like we've said that by this time next month you will not be able to get the palm rich estate phase six for that amount so the amount is going way up as you can see on the screen so take advantage take advantage take advantage and um we'll be able to you know assist as the um our plots are available especially the offer where you're buying one hectare and you're getting a free plot of motherland smart city of course we have our residential estates we have the visionary garden city which is still selling we have the motherland very important the motherland estate is one that is taking shape in all forms also uh, the phase one of motherland which is right there in k um ensure that you are able to make that decision today the cfo is in progress and ensure you're making that decision today because once you're able to let me explain the business of real estate you know real estate today we are envying the big players the people who have been able to make these decisions and are you know real estate moguls and are living in financial stability and have been able to acquire so much wealth for themselves what did they do they acquired these properties when others were looking away when others were saying oh this place is not yet developed this place is not yet developed or this place there is no major this here when those developments come at that time you would not be able to afford those properties imagine if you are buying now and it's developed and you are selling at the cost of that developed price that is what real estate is all about when we talk about real estate that is real estate in its simplest form making decisions when others are not able to make that decision and you enjoying from the decision you have made because at the time they are ready they are coming to buy for you from you and that's wonderful that's one um, point i want us to get to to begin to think about the future because most of don't talk about the future the future a lot of us think the future is far away it is it's one thing that you know you have to you know leave for so long to me in this now uh, in what month the month of april this is the same year that we just you know we said happy new year what looks like yesterday the future is closer than we think that we can imagine and motherland smart city is one future you should be a part of you need to be a part of it has all the amenities of what a real estate property should be of what a real estate future should be and we should ensure that we are able to be a part of that future um we also have our <clears throat> palm fortune city phase one is still open is still um selling the palm fortune city phase one is still selling uh we have there you can get the palm fortune city we have the residential plots on which you can you know for those of us who have not seen i've said it times and again if you know you've not seen the layout you've not seen the model for palm fortune city please request for it now let it be sent to you see the future you have an opportunity to belong to the palm fortune city residential is available the commercial plots are available the agro processing district and the agricultural boulevard for those of us who want to or we have people who want to engage in any agricultural practice other than oil palm tree 
you can do that you can achieve that future you can achieve that dream by buying a plot or plots or acres hectares in the palm 40 city boulevard so what the palm 40 city boulevard offers you is to have your agricultural practice your farm in a secure and gated estate not just that you're close to a processing zone you're close to a commercial zone and you're close to a residential zone which means your off takers your market is right around you it's right before you so anything you are cultivating you have a ready market and this is one that we should ensure that we take full 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 advantage of and ensure that we are able to also speak spread the word and speak to as many persons as possible so we can um maximum success together and build that future the future is there for the taking for those who make the right decisions today the difference between you and most of the successful people on earth now is the decisions they made years before the decisions they made years before and now you're hearing you're seeing the opportunities that they were able to see and they were able to hear many years before you have a decision to make and you should make those decisions now so yes mr chairman let's go to the next estates open for sale while we run up on palm 42 city so palm 42 city phase one i've said before take advantage take advantage take advantage listen i'm repeating this because imagine when people were talking about the plots of land available in canaan land or a redemption camp many years before a lot of people's persons will say no this place how many years will it take to open up but today those persons have been forced to eat their words they'll be forced to swallow everything they've said because the truth is that development does not come at your term development will not wait for you until you are ready it won't say because you have pegged this place will develop in 300 years and so it will wait for you if you ask questions about the places you are residing now if you ask questions about what it was five or ten years ago you'll be surprised at what you will hear and these estates you are seeing today you'll be surprised at what you will see in three years in four years to come and the amount these estates will be going for make those informed decisions now let people understand because when you are speaking to people about real estate ensure you're talking about value the idea of oh we're uh, real estate buy land this is the new lagos buy land this it is outdated do not say those things anymore talk about the real value talk about how real estate can secure the future how real estate can be a financial stability plan how would you build the financial stability how with real estate you can you know how with real estate you can achieve that future you want to achieve um please so much to attend to the people who are asking questions in the chat box and provide them with the information they need um i can see a lot of hands up uh, thank you very much prc you got that thank you very much yes so you have any questions you're demanding for documents just, just drop go to the chat box we have a dedicated team out there to answer you to respond to you um thank you so much so um i was saying you need to understand that this value that we are building this value that we're pro um, projecting to the future is what you stand to push out make yourself an ambassador that will be able to change the life of people Palm Ridge Phase 2, um, the Palm Fortune City Phase 2 also is up there on the screen. Demand for these forms, demand for all of it. Um, phone numbers have been dropped. Chat them up and ensure that you have somebody you're talking to, somebody who's answering all your questions. Um, you're, you're able to book meetings. And also, like I've said before, you want um, somebody from the company to speak with you or to speak with somebody. Ensure you go to the right channel, reach out to the office and have that meeting booked and we're able to reach out to you to give you more information we have the flyers all of this property we have the brochure for palm ridge palm ridge brochure is one that explains everything you need to know everything i'm talking about right now you know you are able to send this as a document it has the coordinates the, so gone are the days where you keep asking where people keep asking you and um, i need this i need more information send them a brochure a brochure has all of the all of the information you need it has the information about the property and you're able to you know you close your deals faster and help people make better informed decisions the flyers are available and also we're rolling out a very robust a very robust incentive plan for this project for everyone who was at the launch of palm ridge um you remember also that um, we gave you a flyer that flyer qualifies anybody that comes through you for that incentive so it is a dedicated incentive just for you then i'm going to close by talking about our palm ridge estate phase five in ibadan this is located exactly on iwo road by the express way you have no excuse about this property you have no excuse about this property it has a certificate of occupancy it is directly up by iwo road and again the fruits are or the trees are already fruiting 
there is no excuse whatsoever there is nothing you can say about a property because it ticks all the boxes there is a meal on it and palm oil is being milled on that property every day watch out for the launch the, the allocation of the persons who have keyed into that property we are planning massively for that watch out we are waiting for the state to approve the remaining surveys of the individuals that were giving their surveys and their documents once it is released we have all roads lead to palm fortune phase five for the allocation and the truth is that it is selling out fast this is the time to make your decision because you would not see properties you will not see a plot in that property soon and at that time nobody can do anything there is because those trees cannot grow overnight so if you know that the palm fortune city phase and uh, palm rich estate phase five sorry is what makes more sense to you or is what will make more sense to your prospects please ensure you are pushing it out to them and ensure that they are making that um uh, all of that um decisions now so um, ensure Palmish Phase 5. Palmish Phase 5 has one of the most robust brochures. If you know you've not gotten a brochure of Palmish Phase 5, please request for that brochure right now. The Palmish Phase 5 brochure. Let me tell you why you should have that Palmish Phase 5 brochure. The Palmish Phase 5 brochure gives you every information about the Palmish project. It tells you the total worth of that project in figures. It tells you our roadmap, our plan to get listed on the stock exchange. It gives you all the documents on that land. It's all on the all on the brochure. It gives you the options: the option A, which is the ownership; the option B, which is the investment part. It gives you everything broken down. So if you have somebody you need to speak to, please just request on that brochure. And once the person goes through that brochure, trust me, you've you've landed a client. Once you read that brochure, you are able to make an informed decision. It is practical. It tells you about the figures. It gives you all the information you need. Please request for the public brochure now. In request for the subscription form. Request for the video. Request for the video. So we have those videos on YouTube. So it's very easy. You are not downloading something that is so heavy to you know um, cover up your gallery. It's right there. It's available on um, what was it called on YouTube. Request for the link. Once the link is, is dropped to you, you can watch it. So you see all of these things you're seeing. These are not internet pictures that have been collected from somewhere and refined for you. These are actual videos of people on site. You will see when we went to that estate. You have a feel of the estate itself. And before the launch, before the allocation of that estate, ensure you have received. You know you have acquired your plots and everyone you know have acquired their plots uh, right there in ibadan ibadan is one of the fastest growing cities in west africa you can check this out it's available on public domain and we should ensure we are making all of those decisions right now make all of these decisions request for these materials have materials that will enable people have make informed decisions real estate has passed the level of talking of begging Give people information, let them see the value, and they'll be able to make informed decisions. They will call you and make those decisions. So send them this brochure, send them the subscription form so they can read the T and C's and see that, see things about the organization and know that this is real. This is for real. This is something that, you know, it is timely and it's something that has the potentials to change the future and ensure that you are not enslaved by the economic instability, you're not enslaved by the currency fluctuation, you're making decisions that whether or not they, whether or not you're, you're making decisions in the coming years or whether or not the economy is crashing or falling, whatever it is, you are able to make, you've made a decision that can give you guarantee for your future. And that is, that is it ladies and gentlemen, why um, asset rise is different and why our products, you know, offer much more than what you're used to in the regular real estate space. So when we think of real estate, we think of value. We think of value, additional value to land, additional value to, you know, why a person should, you know, get real estate. How can we maximize the potentials of real estate? Trust me, gone are the days where you tell people, um, buy land and uh, just wait. Because there are many persons who have lands who are still not wealthy. So the truth is that real estate, true agro real estate, true agro real estate model, um, palm rich in question, is one that you know gives us that you know level of financial stability, gives you that financial security, especially, most especially, your retirement plan. A time will come where we all cannot work at the extent we are working now. We all may have the strength now to jump out at 8 a.m. or 7 a.m. and return by 7 p.m. or 8 p.m. just to make work for a living, to get a salary at the end of the month a time is coming you will not be able to do that again and also a lot of us what we are spending now is just for ourselves you're able to take care of yourself in a month or you and your wife or you and your wife and one kid and all of that a time will come that the bills will increase 
you know you will need to pay more you will need to have you have more expenses and that is where you will need all these channels of income these revenue channels in your life that is where you will look back and be happy and smile at the decisions that you were able to make and know that you've made the right decisions um thank you very much once again for your time um somebody will be available to take the questions but i'll be here also in case there are some questions you want me to take for you um to answer for you or any clarifications you want me to give and also i want to tell you that i am going to be right here to give instant discounts on any of these estates so i'm going to be available at, for this webinar i'm going to be giving instant discounts so if you have somebody you're talking to requesting for a discount or you want to make a purchase and you are you need a discount on any of the of the properties now here ask those questions say it now make those requests and i'll be available to give discounts somebody's already asking how much discount talk about the property that you want to buy go to the chat box now and why i'm still live while i'm still live i'm going to be giving out discounts so the first 20 persons i'm going to give you 20 discounts so i'm um, mrs choma over to I'm you, with you, I'm with you sir. all right thank you thank you take it up from here people who right, are making buying so decisions in the next 24 okay. hours we're, we're going to be offering them discounts all right all right sir thank you so much mr sebastian thank you for your time okay so i understand that a lot of us have a lot of questions to ask either as regards the products or i will just calm down we're going to talk about prc and how you could get started because we, we're just trying to make um empower people and then um, make people earn from this as well so um as regards question on our products as Mr. has been able to enlighten us on all our products we have the residential product and we have the agro related products which is the primary estates and we've sold that phase one phase two phase three and we're currently selling phase four phase five and six we just launched phase six. Okay, so that's for the agro related products. We also have the residential, which I was able to explain. But for those who want to um, key into the promo, or you have someone currently you're talking to, you can just send a hi to the number I sent to the group chat. So we could take it up from there. Send a hi with the uh, with, with the um, your most preferred estates. So I could take it up from there after this um, session. So if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. What well, the floor is open for questions now. I can see Lola hand off. Lola, can you go first? Okay, if you're not available, or will I be, are you available for your question? Okay, so if you have any question, please go ahead to ask your question now. Hello? Akira, to me, please go ahead to ask your question. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, Mom. So please, um, if you have a question, please go ahead to ask your question. I can see a lot of people raising up their hands. Is that the time you don't have questions? Anyway, my, my only question here is, um, do you do a uh, commercial plot for Cambridge 6? And if there is, how much discounts can people get from them? If they want to be in a commercial plot for Cambridge 6. Okay, how much discount? Okay, Mr. Sebastian, you have someone asking, um, how much discounts can you? Yes, we do commercial plots. Mr. Sebastian, are you here? Yeah, I'm here. I'm right here. So, uh, but okay, you have someone question. asking how much discounts do you want to give for that commercial piece of Palm Beach Estate? Which estate, please? Do you do Palm Beach uh, Estate? Mr. Choma, the persons who are interested, just go into, um, respond to them on your chart. I've given, I've sent you the, the discounts for all the products. Check your um, chat box. All right, all right, sir. <laughs> Okay, okay. okay. So good news to all. Good news, good news. We have um we have twenty percent discounts for anyone who wants to key in within twenty four hours, or if you have a client who you're currently speaking with and um he or she want to key in 
within 24 hours you can get a discount of 20 percent on any of our estates 20 percent off on any of our estates so like i said we have residential estates and we have agro real estates um and the minimum for our agro real estate is 495,000 naira per plot 495,000 naira per plot then the minimum for our residential estates is 850,000 naira 850,000 naira okay so before i go ahead with some trc continue prc i still have some persons who are raising up their hands please feel free to ask the questions now hello good afternoon ma hi good afternoon please if i'm buying um one acre in the first six is that discount for the state free because i didn't hear your last statement I said, is there a discount for the statutory fee or is the person paying no. 600 times 6 for the oh, statutory fee? Paying. Okay, so we have um, an existing discount for statutories, which means that the person pays 600,000 euros for a plot and pays 500,000 euros for five plots. Do you understand that? Okay, thank yes. you. So that's just it. <laughs> All right, so I see how I came over to me. Can I hear you? Hello. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Uh, please, uh, I want to, I want to ask, if you want to request for a book or online, can it be uh, uh, sent through this flash rider or because of the uh, where I have? Okay. Where are you currently, please? Mm, currently now, I'm somewhere uh, around the states. Okay, what if you have the soft copy? Soft copy, okay. That's yes, good. I, I'm going to send the soft copy to you. So, um, um, I'll send that to the group chat. Then you can pick it up from there. Or you trust the number on the chat box. Okay, okay. Yes, please. Okay. okay. Alright. Yeah. Any other question? I'm sorry, Chama. Let me get it right. Are you saying that people can still get a discount also on statutory fee? No, 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 no. What I'm saying that we have an existing, as we have an existing discount that you could get. Because the lady, the lady asked earlier about statutory fee. I think he told her that. We're so, about what about that for the assignment, we charge just one. So we charge one for the assignment. Hello, can you hear me? Oh yeah, well yeah, we know that. Okay, there's no discount. Yeah, so that is why I explained. There is no yeah, there's no promo per se. It's just that we give a discount because we charge only one deed of assignment for every number of plots you buy. Okay, just to make it clear to everyone that are new, I know this fact, but just to make it clearer, then okay. there is no discount on statutory fee. But however, if anyone is ready to pay in now within the next 24 hours, you will be getting 20% discount on any of the estates you will be buying. And the reason why there is no discounts on statutory fee is because that has nothing to do with the land. It's just something that has to do with the government and the development fee. So I'm just saying this for the purpose exactly. of the people that I have brought in so that they know that they are not getting discount on statutory fee, but they can get exactly on any of the estates they wish to key in into right now within the next 24 hours. Yeah, exactly. Thank, Thank you so you. much for that. Good evening. Mr. Joseph, I can see your hands up. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Yeah. Please, uh, no, I came late. I came very late. But I want to know more about that uh, farm rich fortune. I don't really understand it. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Can you can you can you please excuse yourself from the noise in your background? Okay, Mr. Akira to me. You can ask your question. Hello, Mr. Akira to me. Can you go ahead?
Okay, so please do. If you have any question, please go ahead and ask your question. Shama, I think he just wanted to basically explain Pam Fortune to you. He was not here. He just wanted to explain that again. What Pam Fortune means or whatever. Okay, okay, okay. All right, well, so Pam Fortune, we have two faces of Pam Fortune City. Mr. Shedrack, are you in the house? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I have I have gotten your question. Okay, okay, I'll answer that now. Pound Fortune City with is of Pound Fortune City. We have the phase one, which consists of five different districts. We have which consists of five. We have the residential district, we have the agro boulevard district, we have the commercial districts, we have the agro processing district. And we have come with essence with four. So if I if I, I would send the um 3D design, so you will see how this is being designed into um, um the estates. So the idea of the estate is to be a self-sustaining estate whereby you have you can leave estate, you can still have your company and you can still enjoy the ecological environment. So we have the palm trees as a design for the estate. So that's for phase one. For phase two, we currently have we currently have we're currently selling for seventy thousand naira, where we are um, um, currently pl planting for our customers. We are currently running oh, um, it, rental it, income, it, yeah. land rental income. Hello, can you hear me? I can hear you. I can hear you. No, I'm okay. I'm coming back. Okay. 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 So for the phase two, we currently have we currently have a project what we call land rental income, whereby customers of uh, so five to the land and we plus and give you rental income annually on your land. However, this estate is still a residential estate. Just that we are only trying to um make customer end from their um from the land for now at least for the next three years before we can start building instead of leaving the land falling. So that's what uh, we have on that phase two as a plan. So that's the difference between phase one and phase two. I hope that is clear. Yeah, 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 thank you. All right, you're welcome. So, do we have any other question? Hello, good evening. Hi, good evening. Hello, this is Mr. Joseph Manola. Hi, good evening. I can tell you. All right. So, I want to ask: Is it possible for a client that just bought a four plot of land at a phase five in Badon, and he has paid all our money finished, including the stationary charges? So, is it possible for the client to convert to one entrance, which is fifteen plots? The, the client has paid already for all the documentation. Yes, I uh, yes, uh, including the stationary charges. So we are waiting I for see. allocation now. So is it possible yeah, for to convert to 15 plus? No, sir, it's not possible. Why? Because you already paid for the charges and we signed, we signed processing already. So we can't retrieve the document that has been processed. Okay, when is the next allocation for Ibadan? The date is not out yet, but once we do, when once we fix the date for that, we will definitely communicate on the platform. All right, thank you. You're welcome. All right, do we have any other question? Okay, yeah, Hello, ma. good evening. Okay, okay maybe Hi. you should go first. Okay, please, I want to ask in the flyer that we got on the um launching day for Palm Ridge Escape with Six. Okay, so I saw the payment plan per plot. I saw for three months 166,000, 165,000. Like that, like that, then the statutory charges. So, I want to ask is it after like somebody that chose 24 months and is paying 28,875? Now, after okay. the two years, is it when is it after the two years that the person will pay the statutory charges? Okay, that's noted. No, because you can, we, we advise that the person um, pays a new charges while spreading payment for the land. So, you have two years, we'll give you a plan to um, spread your payment for just the land. Why okay. you're paying for this, you can as well pay for the oh, okay. Yes. Okay, then but how much that, is the initial? That, if that cannot be achieved within the um, duration of two years, two years. Okay. we can we can then maybe give an additional three months or six months to that customers, don't as you reach out to us. Okay. We'll do that. Okay. Yes. So then I want to ask, what is the initial deposit per plot? For, for which I six weeks? For Palm Ridge for six. For Palm Ridge Phase 600,000 for the outright payment. 100,000. Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, do we have another question? Yeah, okay, good evening. Hi, good, good evening. evening. 
Good evening. Good evening. So, my question, I don't know if it is a Sasera still that will answer me on June. Whatever, okay. what I want to ask is then concerning the Palm Rich Estates project, the Agro Real Estate project. Now, okay. these um, lands that are marked out, marked out for palm protein and all that, are they, are they restricted by government as farmlands? That's one of my questions. Are they just, is there a restriction? Are they just cut out to be farmlands? Okay. They are actually cut out for that project. For the project, for the okay. Project. Yes, that's oh, the rest okay. of that project. For that project, okay. And so we say that um, this project can, um, these palm trees can fruit for as long as 30 to 50 years. When More than I, yes. Okay, let's let's even peg it at fifty years. At the end of fifty years, what can I use the land to do? Is it to continue farming with it? I can't decide to build on it at the end of fifty years, can I? Okay, so um, of course we are, um, we are looking out for development, which will come in anytime, maybe 30, 50 years, and uh, and that as you know, real estate is not is not stagnant. It's not stagnant. So in that year, if um adventure the area is already developed for residential we'll definitely okay. go into that we'll definitely go let, into that let, let me call you can as well sell okay mr sebastian is here all right okay. okay to answer your question uh, the first um, question is why designing the layout for the obvious estates? we already submitted that we're going to be doing that on that property but the truth is that even before the 30 years the land already has graft classifications into residential Oh, yeah, so, but you know, one thing with residential is you can have a residential plot and still plant on it if you want. But whether it's strictly it's because you are cutting okay. your palm trees, you must still strictly do palm tree or do farming. No, no, no. It's open to okay. Yes, yes. After gratification, land, all lands we have built on now, they were they were farm lands before. Wow. That's those places you know in, in Lagos, those Agege areas, Okoba. Yes, they were wow. all yes, you can ask people before. So as um, what was it called? Lands. Mostly usually every ten years agricultural okay. lands get classification into um residential. Reason being okay. um yes, reason being um to accommodate population. Okay. Also okay. still a lot of residential, also moving up to um uh, what was it called? Um commercial as the case may be. Yes, so so as, yes. Yes, so to answer your question, yes, it's you are free to do anything you want to do on the land. It's not okay. a restricted to farming years after those periods. Okay, brilliant. And then another thing, sir, I think this should be going to you, please. Some of us just came on board a few days ago, and then we, we just discovered there's a discount on Palm Ridge Estate for six, and um, we want to maximize that. Is there anything the company can do for, for at least for the purpose of some of us that just came on board and extend the period on Palm Ridge Estate Phase 6? Yes, we, we love the old um, instant fruiting of Palm Ridge Estate Phase 5 and we are into that too. We are, we are going to get the brochure and stuff. But for Palm Ridge Estate Phase 6, is there a possibility for the promo to be extended for the purpose of some of us consultants that are just coming on board with asset rise, please? Um, all right, we'll, we'll look into that. We'll look into that. You see, that's the wonders of real estate and um, um, you know appreciation. Yes, thank you um, so much. I wanted to ask that matter. <laughs> so the, the the truth is, for those of us who went to Palm Ridge Estates for the launching, you will see opposites. You will see that we're already we're already molding blocks. Yes. Blocks are being molded. Even while we were yes, yes, like yes. opposite, those blocks are offensive. Yes. Yes. The fence is going round. So and wow. all of this is small value on the land. But what you're saying yes, we're going to raise it. Um I'm we're gonna look at it tomorrow um in our management yes, meeting and I will ensure I move for that to be done so we can give some time to it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I have a lot of people talking about but they are waiting All right, all right. We'll look into that tomorrow and we'll, we'll have an information for you for how long we'd like to um take it up. So, um, right. so Mrs. Mrs. Chinway, Mrs. Choma, please let's look at this tomorrow so that we can right. accommodate this. All right, sir. All right, sir. All right, so we still have a lot of persons who are raising up their hands for questions. Please go ahead. Yeah, I was raising up my hand. Good evening. Hello. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Because I just joined, so I don't really know much. I was all these different questions. I have interest. I don't know if it, I can be brief, or maybe I have a child to brief me. Uh, real estate, residential farm. I don't know which one to go. 
I've not seen the flyer. Say somebody just sent the link to me now, so and I just joined. Okay, okay. okay. all right. So I'll be sending a number be. on the chat box. Please chat the number after the session so that you get all the information you need to get. Possibly we might have to book a personal meet with you to communicate all that. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay. Hey, I didn't get the number. I'll call you. Oh nine oh three three seven five six six zero five. Five. Hi. Yes. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, sir. Um, it is uh, Mr. Patrol on the line. Okay, good evening, sir. Um, there's, a, there's a particular particular question you answer uh, regarding farm which I think uh, this farm, the bad one. Okay. So, I think Mr. Joseph asked a question now. Now, uh, guys, it, it's, uh, it, it's talking about a particular claim. Who paid for four plots of land? And uh, it has stayed in full to a charges. But this land has, has not been allocated to the body. And this client is contemplating on switching from four plots of land to uh, like 15 plots. Hello? I can I'm with you. you. You can continue with your question, sir. It's contemplating on switching from four plots to 15 plots. And this land has not been allocated to, to her. I think you people should do something about as in how to make it happen for her rather than saying it cannot be possible because that's what he told mr joseph when he had the, the question he said it can't be possible all right let, let, let me explain something when we talk about allocation allocation is not just taking somebody to a plot of land mounting a piece of block and saying this is your land allocation is actually a physical representation of documentation on that particular property yes so at the point a person finished a payment we start processing that document in your name so what you are seeing is that lagos state open states have gone further with their lands and registry they are more efficient than Oyo your state in terms of land and registry so for people who have bought lands with us from lagos and in Oyo state you will see that the process to do these things is faster because they are used to many real estate companies they have a robust structure even as a company the delay is affecting us but you can't do anything when you're working with with government i don't know if you understand and we are doing everything possible to ensure that we have that allocation for ibadan done as soon as possible so in terms of switching which the person was talking before talking about before, what we meant was that if you've paid in full, we have already paid the statutory charge for your processing of your allocation. So indirectly, we have not just shown you the, we have not just take, taking you to the property, but all the um, things we need to do for allocation has been done. So that's why we are saying it may be on the difficult side. However, for me to know the particular person and the cases that we are really dealing with, so we are not giving a holistic answer to different um what was it called issues which may be the case now i think probably you should reach out reach out to me or if in way and we'll look at this individually and be able to offer you know tailor-made um solutions into the um cases as the okay. uh, as it may be so just reach out and give me the names let's let me know exactly what is wanted and know what we can do and advise them for what we can all do together okay 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 thank you very much what on that side? Okay. So you get us a right. contact to reach out. All right, is the contact already on the chat box? You could reach out to the number there. We'll attend to your accordingly. Okay, thank you. All right, thank you so much, sir. All right, we still have some person hands up. Um, just a, just a, um, a quick question I want to ask. What is the difference between mother land? I'll take you in other water and farm fortune. Hello. Hello. Okay, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you now. Do you hear All right, can you come again with a question? Like you gave a question. You, just for the benefit of every other person, what is the difference okay. in motherland? Two in Ota and then Pam Fortune Two. Okay, so Moneyland um, Smart City 
at um anything else are, is actually not for sale so what we're trying to do is we're trying to build a free zone like a, a, a district for um prospects or for clients who buys into up to an hectare and come for city so that's that zone is just going to be the free zone for customers who buy up to 15 plots so it's strictly residential and it's just carved for customers in that category not for sale and is it still going to be within the um, palm ridge and um, palm fortune city um, palm fortune city? is it going to be in yes. the same area yes yes yes, yes. Uh, same area Okay, it's just going to be a part that is cut out. Ex exactly. It's just going to be a district, yes. What if so, people buy an hectare for, of agro? Okay. What if somebody buy an AM um, and sorry, it's not hectare, acre. Are they entitled to freelance? One hectare of them, um, palm, whatever, whatever. Okay, agro. so currently, currently we have an ongoing promo for um, customers who buy up to six plots. Not palm rich now, but a residential plots. Okay, let's so, what about the agro? Agro city? Are they entitled to one plot? No, they're not entitled to one plot. The boulevard? The boulevard, they're not entitled to one plot. Okay, oh. so for the boulevard, if you buy up to one acre, you get one plot. Okay. But for the palm ridge, if you buy an hectare, you get one plot from the modern and the city. Yeah. I'm just asking for the benefit of the people that are asking the Yeah, yeah. So, for all our residential estates, we have an ongoing promo for buy six, get one free. So you're getting the one free plot of that same residential estate. But for Palm Ridge Estates, if you buy an hectare, you get one plot free at Motherland Smart Street. That's the free zone. Okay. Yes. Then, just another quick question on Ibadan. Okay. Um, do I, uh, can I just understand it that once I finish Spain, say somebody buy Ibadan now, like the other guy that was talking about four plots, they can start yeah. earning. Since they and while they are waiting for their papers, they can start earning from the from Ibado. Yes, they can. As long as you're done paying, you can okay. start earning. But we just advise that you can start earning after the first day. Only, only, that, only if you want to start earning monthly or quarterly. But then we advise that to get the money, like to to get uh, something here out of it. You can start earning annually. That's after one year. As yes. long as you're done paying for both the charges and the land costs. I think you still work out fine for that person as well because at the end of the day they can start earning from their four plots straight yeah, exactly. away. Exactly. Even if they're not allowed to switch, the advantage yeah. is that they don't have to wait for three years. They can even start earning straight away from there. Exactly. So exactly. at the end of the day, it's still all good. That's what I think. Yes, exactly. Hello. Sorry, sorry, please. Can I quickly ask this question? How many more acres or hectares do we have left in Palm Beach SD Phase 5? I'm talking about Ibado now. Oh, do we have left we for sale? How many more do we have left? Yes. We still have hectares for sale. As, as much as um, 15 no, how many how many more? We still um, have. We, as, we, as we, have, as we, we have a lot. We have a lot. We have a lot. In yeah. Ibadan. Ibadan. Yes. Okay, thank you. Yes. Hectares, thank you. Yes. Then please, can you just give me, can you just highlight a little? What features is asset rights providing in motherland that we are giving to our clients when they buy one hectare of Adodo? What, what features what features right, are we then, providing yeah. them? all right motherland when we say free it's not as if it's a, a free estate just that we've not okay. launched it for sale the model of motherland is to give an estate um that you know people in diaspora can look up to as you know one that is you know connecting them to africa that's what we named so the idea is to have motherland in every state of nigeria every state in nigeria will have a motherland, motherland. estate yes okay, and okay okay the, okay. the, the motherland yes, mother yes. Mm. so every state so that motherland is the motherland in Ogun state okay. so we are still going yes we are still going to have we are still going to, going to sell from that estate but for now we are not selling yet you we are okay. using it yes as to encourage people to because to, for you yes. to buy some for you to you know have a residential estate somewhere there should there must be an interest in that place for you Yes, so, exactly. So that is yes. So we're up, that's how we opened it up. So it's still okay. going to have all the amenities of every asset right mm, Yes. So it's not going to be like it's not going to be like oh because you did not pay for it. Oh, uh, you just have one free land. No, no, thank no. You, it is still thank a you. standard estate. Just that we have some plots in it. 
to say Thank this you. is the residential estate. We are going to give our first subscribers who do this volume the opportunity mm. to key in here. Yes, it's still an Thank estate you. that's still going to be fenced, gated with its gatehouse and everything. So it's not Thank like we're just opening up somewhere and saying, "Oh, it's a plot of land. Go and have it this one bush." Anything uh, like your farmhouse? Did you Thank pay? You. Did you pay for it? Did you pay any more? Yeah, no. <laughs> I no. Thank you. It's, it's, Thank yes, you so it's much. Still an estate. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. So, do we have any other question, please? Sorry, somebody's asking me, how long is the discount going for? Somebody. Oh, <laughs> okay, so the discount. Somebody's asking me now, how long? How, how long is that discount? Twenty percent discount going for? Twenty percent discount. Mm -hmm. Twenty-four hours, please. Okay, okay. Post. Okay. Okay. Do we still have another question? Okay. Another question from them. How far is Palmridge Six away from Palmridge Four? Okay. Yeah, are you there? Hello. How far is what? Sorry, man. How far is what? Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, sorry. They're asking the how okay, how so far is Palmridge Space Four away from Palmridge Space Six? And are they going to be gated together, or are they going to be separate estate that is fenced separately? Every so phase, me. every phase is gated differently, but the estates are not far from each other. But it has its own separate because the phase one is a different model so if you see that and layout it's different the phase two also is different but they are they are not far from each other however it's two different fences two different gates two different okay. entrances yeah oh okay even phase one and phase two they are different entrances yeah yes yes yeah okay what about phase six same as yes no when I, when I mean when i say phase six you know which one if at um, phase six is not about no. phase six is adodo i'm talking about adodo yes yeah, but you're talking about alpha. four and six four yeah, and six four right and six, yeah, sorry, no, yes right? they are they're in the same location so i'm saying that however they have different entrances different gatehouse okay and they yeah. have different layouts yes different layouts also okay but like but the it's same location are, okay yeah. now is the phase six still going to have like residential in between and just like the it's not designed Currently, is, is a palm rich is a palm rich zone. We don't have residential. No. What about commercial for the palm rich six? No, we've not we've not launched that. But now phase six is palm rich. Yes, phase six is palm rich. Basically, just palm rich. So the commercial yes. is just from the old from the from, old. Yeah, area. from the other from phase four. Okay, now we get it. Yes. Thank you. We thought there was palm rich phase six commercial. Okay then. Yeah. Thank you. And how? Okay, that's it. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Um, can you hear me? I think I lost the network at some point. Yeah, we can hear you. Hello. Okay. So, do you have any other question? Do we have any other question? Okay, I can see Doctor raising up his hand. Please go ahead, sir. Okay. All right. I think for now, we don't have any other questions. We could now go back to PRs. Please, you can ask your question. I can see your hands up. Okay. I can see from um, hope the free land has no salary charges. Yes, the free land, you don't need to pay for salary charges. For Motherland Smart City Phase 2, you don't need to pay for salary charges for now. For those who are getting it for free, those salary charges have been killed. For now or at all? At all. I mean, for those who are getting for free, you don't need okay. to pay some new Yes. When we, so when we so what, what she means by for now is do, for this period, for this period, for this promo. Okay. Okay. Thank yes. You. For this promo now, once you're getting is a, a, a free plot, it's totally free. So both land and status free charges are covered by the company. Okay. Okay. Thank so somebody asking sorry again that they buy commercial plot one acre, we get a free land. Would they, they get one acre of commercial plot? Would they get a free land? Uh, that's for phase four. Yes. Uh, for Pamford City, rather. Yes, you will. Yes. 
Yes, we'll give you a review. We'll give you a plan. For a commercial plot. Yes, yes we'll give you a review. Okay. okay. Hello, sir. Hello, ma'am. Hello, we can hear you. Madam, okay, okay, okay. Sorry, a client asked me this question. I told him I was going to get back to him because I truly didn't have an answer for him. Now, he said when he, if he, if he pays for Palm Beach Estate, buys his hectares and starts earning, we have pegged the income per year on a plot at 360000 that, that, what I mean by that is, uh, uh, he knows that 60% of the 360 is what's coming to him, while 40% is staying with the company because of the value they have provided. Now, what he's saying is, he asked me, he said, well, as we proceed into the other years, we are looking into 30 years, and looking into 50 years, palm oil would likely increase in the cost. You understand? The price will most likely increase. Will we remain at 60 for the whole 3, 30 years or 50 years? Or we will be reviewing that income too as the value of palm oil increases. So I just thought... Palm oil, I'll the value of palm oil, no, the no, value no. of palm oil is what determines the amount they earn. So if palm oil okay. goes to 100,000 a gallon, so okay. the 360 is because you are getting 12 gallons. So any amount as it's increasing, your mo your income is increasing. It's not cast okay. on rock that this yeah, yes. Oh. We're only telling you the current amount now. Oh okay. and as palm oil is going up, your um, the, your revenue is going up. Okay, 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 okay. I don't and know if you I understand me. I understand you now, sir. I thought it was actually pegged as per flat. So we leave it at 360. No, 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 it's not flat, it's not flat. It's not flat, okay. it's based on current okay. earnings. Yeah. So as it's going up, the person is earning more. Okay, at least I know palm yeah. oil hardly goes down. It can't go down. It, 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 can't it, go down. Least, it has never gone down yet. Yeah. <laughs> so because okay. we've so been able to meet the demand, so you just okay. see that, as, and you know, because it's quoted on the floor of the stock exchange, you are able to know how much it is, the cake is going for. So you just know okay. and as it's appreciating. For example, That's people who earn this year, People yes, end this year end more than people what they end last year, and next year also. Um, next yes, year please. also, it is also yes you like that. Move. And Thank also you. yes, we need to also establish that when you have a primary property, it is not a must that we must be the one harvesting so, yes, and so, milling or yes, selling for you. It's not yes, a must. Yes. yes. So if you have an option that is cheaper. You are very free. It is your land, it is your trees, it is your production. It is. It is only. We are only telling you that our cost. That is what we will charge. So if you want to put a farm manager that has cheaper options and all of that, it, or you don't want to mill, you want to sell out the farm front like that. Anything, okay. anyhow, you put it, yes, it is. It is allowed. So there is right. no contract that ties you that. Oh, you must work with asset rights. There must be. We must be the ones to harvest them. No, no. We don't we don't do such yes, we don't put such obligations on our on our clients and our landlords. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Asset Ryan. All right, so do we have any other question? Mr. Taiwo, I can see your hands up. Actually, um, yeah, yeah, I just wanted to you are how are you? Fine. Thank you. Yeah, so um, I, I wanted to ask about so you're giving out twenty percent discount on the property. Um, are you doing it for the commercial ones? Okay, yes, we are. We will. Okay, cool. Um, all right then. And I wanted to ask, um, so for the payout for the palm, for the palm tree, um, when that comes, uh, like, did you say you take 40%? Yes, we take 40% and you take 60% that's if you want us to manage the palm trees for you well if you want to manage yourself we guarantee that that's what you can earn from your palm trees because we have some persons who understand palm tree management they can actually mill they understand the process they can sell for themselves but then if you don't want to go through those stress we will do that for you but then we we'll take a shares of 40 percent and you take 60 percent and you see whilst the palm trees is, is growing do they prune the leaves like to make it grow taller or is that how it grows taller so I didn't hear you. The way the way they're growing the palm trees, way to go taller, is it because they're pruning the leaves? No, th these are hybrids. These are hybrid trees. So they are dwarf species. 
it's easier to manage it's easier to harvest so they are these are the tenera species is high yielding species super gene species so they don't grow like the local species that grow so high they grow short like that so and they're able to expand they're able to grow bigger and house small palm fronds so what is it tenera or super gene or is it tenera yes. no tenera is a super gene species is it tenera these are tenera species okay so super gene is tenera no they're so when you say super gene you have a variety of super gene species there's a oh, malaysian oh. super gene I don't know if you know about that, but it doesn't grow well in Nigeria due to our climate. The best, the best um, hybrid species for our climate is the tenera. Okay, uh, thank yeah. you. Thanks for educating me on that. Okay. Yeah, you're welcome. Thank you so much. All right, Mr. Sunday, I can see your hands up. Okay, um, I just want a further clarification on this issue of 60 40 percent. If access right is the one harvesting, processing the palm fruits and the cell because what i'm aware of before is 70 30. i'm just hearing 60 40. and most of the time when i'm discussing with some of my clients i told them 70 30 percent for them but now i'm hearing 60 40. so i don't need a clarification on that so that i won't be telling them 30 percent again that's what i want to uh, want to find out am i Hello. 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 Yeah. Sorry, I didn't get the last part of your question. Miss Choma, did you get it? I didn't get the last part of the question. He said thirty percent. Is it thirty percent or forty percent? What's the payout? It's sixty forty. Sixty percent to forty percent. Okay. Who takes sixty? Who takes forty? The, the the landowner takes sixty percent. Okay, the last one I take sixty percent, yeah, and yeah. the other side take forty percent. Yeah, that's if we are the one harvesting, milling, managing, and selling. Okay. Yes, okay. but if we are, that's only when that is applicable. Okay. Yes. Yeah. This is Chairman. Are you here? Hello, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Okay, Mr. Sunday, right. I've, I've, Mr. Sunday's question will be answered. Yes, I've yes. answered that. Oh, yeah. okay, okay, okay. Okay, so do we have any other person who have questions on this chat box? If you have a question, please feel free to ask. Okay, why there is no question? I'd like to say that um, PRC is um, actually so in There's a question on the chat, in the chat thing, though. There's a from Mr. Zubi, Adu Fatal, something like that. There's a question on the chat. Tim, are you there? Jemma, are you there? Mr. Seth, are you there? Yeah, yeah I'm here. I'm trying to check the question. Yeah, Seth, there's, there's a question. question on the chat box. Yeah, there's so a question. So I'm trying to check it, yes. Right. Um, oh, I'm opening it, okay. Oh, the person's raising their hands. It's... Oh, sorry, I can't see it. Zubi, I can't see this question because of the notifications. It says in in regards to zoning. We have a question in regards to zoning. Zones. How do you intend to convert an agricultural land to residential or commercial without legal implications? Yeah. All right, good. So zonings are are internal. Zonings are layouts. Zonings are layouts. So for example, if um, you buy a um, what you call a, a palm rich land, you already have it on your contract that you based on the estate based on the estate regulation. You own, you have um, 30 years. Within that period, you cannot, um, what is it called? You cannot um, convert your, your property as per the district you're buying into. However, for, that is for the palm rich um, um, area. However, for the agro processing and um, um, industrial, you have to maintain that because you can't sell, uh, you can't put a residential property in those zones. 
But for the agricultural parts, we have a timeline where you can do that and we have the regulatory um, 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 backing for that. So all that is on the estate. However, however when you are buying a proce agro processing zone, because by that time you're going to have industries and processing plants around you. So usually it's very difficult to, you know, have all of that converted to residential. In fact, even people for residential would not want to buy such properties. But for the agri, for the agri parts, yes, you're able to regularize all of that. It is allowed after the period as per your contract. Is there any other questions? I'm trying to check um, on the box to see if there's anyone that. Um, um, okay, the person saying motherland. The free plots. So the free plots we're giving at motherland were covering both the statutory charges for you. So please, persons raising your hands, you can just unmute and ask your questions. Uh, and I, Sebastian, I just wanted to ask about um, the Tenero again. And I wanted to say, do you get your Tenero from Knife or do you produce it yourself? No, we don't. We, 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 we will buy from the Nigerian Institute for Oil Palm um, Research, Knife and from Okitupa Oil Palm PLC. They, they have nurseries that, you know, they, the, the, the cultivate them. So we buy them from, um, in, in that, um, as nurseries. We don't, we don't okay. go into nurseries, yes. So we allow the experts to do it. And also, just to add, just because this is our project doesn't mean we handle the planting. The experts also do this. The people from NIFO and Okitipa Oil Palm PLC, NIFO in Edo State, which is Nigeria Institute for Oil Palm Research, and Okitipa Oil Palm PLC, they handle the cultivation and the management, the nursery of all this, uh, the seedlings. So you ensure we ensure that you have the experts doing this for you, not just random people coming to you know to plant or. Um, What's that other name, please? What's the other company? Because I only know Nike. What's the other one? Okitipa Oil Palm PLC in own those states it's one of the biggest okay, um yeah okt pupa oil palm plc okay i okay ti pu pa oil palm plc is in own those states nigeria it's one of the biggest oil palm facilities farms in nigeria okay yes uh, it's I, you can check it has been spelled out yeah thank you, thank you. In direct partnership with us they're in direct partnership with us so they handle the cultivation of these trees so when you're buying a palm rich estate property you know that the experts are working for you and how do we um, benefit from the dividend since you said um your palm, palm rich estate are listed on the nigerian stock exchange no, I didn't say. I said Okispa is listed. We've not listed yet. No, I'm talking we're, about the Ibadan one. I've seen on the Yes, we've not listed, listed yet. We are just we are still in process of listing. So when uh, when we finish when the listing is complete, what happens is that the moment you have um um units in Palm Ridge, you have units from the shares. So that's why it's an it's the, the model is LCC. If you see the brochure, you understand better. It's not a it's an LCC model. So it's an op model that is co-ownership. So your units already buys you already gives you um units of shares. In the in the entire project is this, and is this just for ibadon or all the parameters no for ibadon now ibadon is the first one because okay. it's already fruity you cannot list a product okay, or yeah, project yeah, that is yes that's not yeah. started um bringing in so okay. for now the only one we can list because we've submitted this and we're having um ag mortgage bank help us facilitate this yes exactly so it's because Yes, because it is fruiting. Yes, exactly. Because it is fruiting. So there's a product you are saying you want to list for um, um what was it called? Adodo that has not started fruiting. It okay. is when it's fruiting that you can submit for um um registration on the for stock exchange because okay. you can only require you can only do that on an available product. So that's okay. just the um, difference. Okay. Uh, um, I wanted to know for those who subscribed um earlier this year to the phase five when usually will they get the annual payment is there a specific time or date that those payments are made uh i would also want to know um regarding subscriptions that has to do with more than a plot the issue of statutory charge that are, that are being charged for instance take the survey and documentation and the survey and allocation fee uh is there a way we can re review and i'm speaking in terms of what i i have seen applied in some places 
where for someone buying say an acre which is six plots a survey has the capacity to take six plots one survey so is there a way to make it easier in terms of paying the ancillary charges that you know there can be a review in factoring how you know the money for survey will not be repeatedly paid because you know having to multiply that cost at lot seems a lot enormous and it's not encouraging for me that personally invest and have clients that invest yeah. can there be a way to review that is there something company can do about that the first question i would like to get clarity about is can you mention which of the estates exactly is strictly going to be aggregate based because i've searched for that information i'm not able to get i don't know if it has been given somewhere but I, i'm not able to find it which of the estates will be agri uh, will be agro based for life? Which ones are convertible exactly in the future for residential? So that for clarity, we can tell that when I'm investing in these 30, 30, 40 years, I'm certain that I would definitely have a conversion to residential if you know one would ever need to do that. The last thing I would like to know for now is can we have you know a more exclusive form? Because I think this life for reason that you have seems to be a bit exclusive. I, I just joined not too long. Um, I'm not able to see something that is well fitting for presentation purpose. Uh, you have said you can be available for presentation, but trust me, it may not always work out. Sometimes you just want to get what you need to do as fast as possible. If there's a detailed information regarding all of the Palm Beach estates or specifically some of the other products, you know, beyond the fact that don't seem to cover these questions, uh, can provision be made so that, you know, one is equipped from the work group to accurately answer questions? and then uh, able to do whatever conversion of sales that needs to be done. Uh, I would I would wait for a response at this one. Thank you. I, I'm not able to get, I got all your questions, but I may not be able to pick them up. I may not remember. So I'm going to answer the ones I remember. And you're going to recall um, the questions. I'll start with the last one. We have brochures. So if you have requested for our brochures, you'll be able to get every information you want. So there's a limit to what slides can do. Slides are bullet points. You can't have notes on slides. So there are bullet points and, you know, just indications for you to go by. But for brochures, you can always request for the brochures. And for the Palm Ridge, we have very detailed brochures that gives you everything about the project that you want to know. Trust me. So request for the brochures. I think we have about three brochures for Palm Ridge. And request for all of them and it will give you all the information you need. Um, for um, Agro, the only agriculture estate that we have that is not open for regularization at least is the agricultural boulevard every other one of them is going to be regularized however when an estate is regularized that does not stop you from planting on it but it is government law lands are going to, just the way lands get sized and you have a session so same with um, agro lands being um, um regularized and once you uh what was it called apply for them you get the um classification approved that is not even you can't hold anybody on that it's um government and it's done per area it's not done it's not done per estate so for example you can see a particular community or community lands you know they say they have maybe probably this place has um, seven thousand hectares and it may be um what was it called um agric land and the government decides to gratify five thousand of it if so it's not something that you can say oh no i already sold it for somebody to plant purple so because of that no it, it, it doesn't work that way and also people can apply for their lands and it can that's is um, strictly um, between um individuals and government and for palm ridge we've looked at it we've, as real estate professionals to say of course between now and the next 30 years all of this can also have um the residential um um, approvals for it however people can still continue to do their palm rich um uh, farming on it as they wish as they so wish um i think another question you asked was about the um, costing so for asset rise yes we only give um one so um one deed but for the survey because of our policy our model we actually design our layouts per plot so what we do when we design the layouts per plot is that we already have town planners you know do give us a total cost of all we need to do and with that also we break it down into the cost of survey development survey and development of the uh, properties in future we may look into this but for now we still do our surveys individually per plot and because we do that we are still with uh, um 
we charge per plot of the surveys. So we may look into it, but for now, that is what we do at Asset Rise. So we have that um, individual um, surveys. And it has its advantages also. It helps the landowner, you know, make decisions too. Because we know a lot of people who buy from us, even um, are able to, you know, make even selling decisions, transfer decisions. So you don't have, you know, one survey tying all your properties. But for us, at the moment, what we do is individual surveys per plot where we may look at it into the future maybe for a different estate but this the estates that we currently have on sale we are still maintaining that for individual um, surveys the only thing we're able to do one for is the um is the deed the deed of assignment uh you asked five questions i can't remember the other two please um okay. can you refer so to? The, the, the other question i asked was and i'm gonna make a comment on what you have answered a bit but then let me ask the, the other question i asked was for those who subscribe earlier this year yes okay so people subscribe time? people subscribe at different times so there, there's no one date for everybody so of course your um usually your your year is your um letter of um allocation to and um, one year from that okay yes so the comment so you to make you can make that you are, you, are saying, you are saying exactly on the date of subscription will be the date of the date of the allocation the date of allocation to the one year date of allocation okay so when are, when is allocation going to be done no, yes. not date of allocation. I say letter of allocation. So letter usually, allocation. when you finish paying, yeah. yes, when you finish paying, all monies, have been, uh, all monies have been paid. Yes, that's what I'm saying. And I said that yeah. it is different for individuals. Okay. So there's no one date. Your date may be 14th. The other may be 25th, like that. Okay. Back to my comment. What I wanted mm -hmm. to say is, okay, um, because I give a mass. Currently, there's a discount on the agrodo, and. One, I was considering, let's make an investment. I don't know, it's 7.450 for the whole hectare. Mm. But when yeah. we did the mass of the statutory charge to be paid, it came to mm. about 9.5 million. Mm. And that's the 7.4. And I'm wondering if statutory charge is a whole lot higher than mm. the cost of 48 itself. Yeah. And so I, I try to like, get your point. Explain to us in that's right. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Yeah. I understand your policy. This yeah. is no, it's not about policy now. now. Okay. Same to us okay. in okay. asset rise as a company. Our statutory yes. charges are sometimes 10 times the cost of land we buy. 10 times. As a company, the lands we buy, what we pay as statutory charge is minimum 10 times the cost of the land. It's just like somebody, I hope you are aware that people who buy cars, it costs more to ship the car to Nigeria than what it costs them to buy. So it's not new. When you buy a car abroad, sometimes it can cost you times two to bring that car to Nigeria for well, shipping costs. Yes. I so the, I yeah, so the truth is, yeah, so so the truth is, statutory charges are, you know, very. For example, don't you think it is? It pays us more to say I'm giving you a discount on statutory charge, but sometimes the truth is, it's not that flexible. And there are also, I don't know if you are aware that there are sometimes some companies will tell you that oh, because there's an increase in um, what was it called um, uh, maybe cost of materials, so mm -hmm. there's an increase mm -hmm. in statutory. Also, um, there are some estates that even after allocation, you still need to pay for you to be able to do your developments. We don't do all of that. I don't know if you understand my point. And we know we are a company in business. And we do, when before we can say something costs a certain amount, it's because from our end, we have tried all we can do to ensure we are doing the barest minimum. And also, I want you to understand that as a, our model in asset rise, is not to give any landlord or landowner a reason in five years, in three years, in four years, in 10 years, in 15 years to receive a message to say, oh, um, this there's one charge we didn't tell you about and all of that. So we have to come in. So most of the charge, most of the charge in this has recharge, the truth is that it's not survey. Most of it comes in development. For example, you are, for example, you are buying a palm rich land. Let's take it from there. Asset Rise is telling you that for the next three years, you have a dedicated company that is managing those trees for you for three years until fruiting. Oxupa Oil Pan PLC is not doing that on a friendly basis. There's a contract to pay them. Let's leave fencing of the estates. Let's leave gatehouse. So most times when people measure these things with our existing estates, they don't look at all these things. It means that you have a dedicated team. Let's say, take it for yourself that you are buying a land and planting palm trees. It means that you will pay people salaries for three years, every month, to be taking care of those trees. But in asset rise, we are telling you that, oh, in your development fee, all of this is covered. So as a business, 
the truth is we must do the math because we cannot afford to give you stories i don't know if you understand so this is what forms statutory um, charges and also we must ensure that these estates it is not just to fence and put a signboard we are tied to every estate that we you know we manage we we, we are selling so all of these estates were still the, the truth is a lot of people are going to see that our level of development when we talk about estate development is different from that you're used to in the traditional real estate world it is not it's not just about the gatehouse and the fencing it cuts down to roads it cuts down to street lights it cuts down to gutters so all of these we've looked at all of this and this is what we build in when we say because the truth is we are not even interested in saying oh all landlords and uh, we want to do roads please now uh, pay 50 we don't want to do that we're not interested in all of that so we we don't want a model where we have dropped all the fees to entrap people then when they come in two years five years we begin to say different things at every point in time because we feel we have already brought you in uh, one of our core values is transparency we want to ensure we are 100 percent genuine and 100 percent wants people because we know these people have properties from different places but we want to them to always beat their chest in two years time in three years time to tell people that this money you're asking for me asset rights is not asking it for me and that is because we want to ensure we've done this at the get go from the beginning so that's why we are taking that time to explain to ask to say see this that's why you see we have an escrow bank ag mortgage bank the development levies, the development fees does not come to asset rise. It goes straight to AG Mortgage Bank and it's an escrow account that they only release it for the projects. So it's not like statutory charges or all these charges are funds that drop to asset rise expense account. So we will do a, uh, uh, a webinar one day and we'll call AG Mortgage Bank to really explain what happens when a person makes a payment to asset rise. It's not your regular real estate company that you make payments and it drops to an expense account. No. In asset rise, it doesn't work that way. So I believe when we do that webinar, people will understand what comes to asset rise at the point you make a payment for a property and how this escrow bounds us to ensure that everything we've promised is done. Well, you have made a compelling argument that um, I, 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 I've seen some reason, but then I, I will still, you know, want that, you know, in future it's looked into. We will, we will, we we will because we are a company that is, we are a company that, that continues to, yes, of course, feedback, and, and we go exactly, exactly. of course, it of course, is, no problem. This is my own feedback, and of course, the feedback of friends and investors like myself. I, I would think take it, okay, yes, definitely. We must, we must look at. I would, I I would document this, and I would take yeah. it. Um, yes, of course. And, 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 and we will, we will, because the, the, the truth is, apart from being, apart from being, um, what was it called, staff of asset rise, we are still buying properties, and we have, our families are buying, and of course, feedbacks like this are things that is holistic for us. So we would not want to lose clients and lose people because of these. So definitely, I'll take it tomorrow and definitely I'll discuss it at the board meeting and we'll see how we can, especially for properties that the, um, what was it called? The difference between land cost and statutory charges are alarming. So we'll be able to look into them holistically and see what we can do. And every angle we can cut, um, you know, uh, make the um, cost more favorable. And thank you so much for bringing such feedback rather than just keeping it to yourself uh, because it okay. helps us to look at our processes, helps us to look at our books, helps us to look at our practices and ensure that we are doing what is convenient for our prospects. So thank you so much. Thank, thank you so much. Just to round up, uh, the last yeah. comment I wanted to yes. make, you yes. made, made mention I should get um request for brochure and yes. I will get. I, yeah. I, I recall quite well, I don't know, maybe you need to uh, explain that procedure to me. But I know even there is one or two persons on this call I've reached out to for certain clarity of virtue. Who okay. Do you have to do you? message? Oh, so very sorry. Are you on the are you on the group? Yeah, you said I should I'm tell on, you how I'm, it works. I'm are you on the, the product knowledge group? I'm the product group. group, no, product group. Product are you aware? Group. Yes, are you I'm aware there's a link? Sure that okay, group. probably. So the easiest way for you to get this now is there's a link, there's a Google Drive link where we upload all materials to. Mrs. Choma, please send that link, drop that link in the chat box. So what we do is that we ensure we update that link every time. So what you do, is once you go, you see all the catalogs of all the products and all the documents available on all those, for all those products up to the documents on the land. So Ms. please, Mrs. Choma, ensure that link is dropped now and ensure it is updated and ensure that all brochures for Palm Ridge, all of them, general brochure, phase five, all of it is dropped. So let that be the action point of this meeting that everybody gets those documents and that link. Thank you so much also for raising right. that. 
Thank you. I think that that would be my take. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Hi, Sebastian. Also, I wanted to add to that as well because, um, yeah, I thought I was going to be paying X amount or a certain number, and um, when I must have done the maths after, it was a bigger number that I was paying. So people will make a mistake when they think, oh, this is how much I'm paying, this is how much I need to pay. It's only when you have to like, ask again, going, wait, hold on, let me do the maths with my accountant. And then that's when I found out that what I thought I needed to pay was a lot less. So I had to now rearrange what I wanted and even I had to even get more just so it's worth it. Because mm. if I was getting one plot now, it's not worth it with all the extra charges. So I might as well get an A card and just spread it across the time. So mm -hmm. you need to just have fixed pricing. So, you can't tell me um, to do that. Thank you so much. Yeah. That, that must have been from the person communicating with you because we ensure no, we it wasn't it wasn't, it wasn't my people's fault. It wasn't because obviously I had to go back and ask her mm. like to do mm. everything. It wasn't her fault. I'm just saying okay. All right, I, no come in, I came in we as a short customer and okay. um, right. I wasn't even asking your advisor for advice. I was just mm. going, Look, I want yeah. that one. Can I get that one? Can I spread it over this yeah. time? Yeah. What's the plan? Yeah. So when I've done yeah. my work out now, it wasn't until I, I had to go back and change everything to oh, okay. to sweat out. So you need to show people the full price. The no point item okay. in, just let them see yeah. the total price. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it. total package. Yes, yes. Thank you so much. Well noted. Well noted. Thank you so much, Mrs. Chairman. Please take note of this and um, ensure that this is passed across board. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, I'm, I'll have to join another meeting now, Mrs. Trevor. So if there's uh, any questions I need to answer, let me know. We're having another webinar for eight. I need to join that now. I thank, I thank you so much. Thank you for everyone listening. All right. In conclusion, I'd like to um, also say that um, PRT is in partnership with Lagera and we're currently the only regulated body for legal state certification in terms of real estate. So please, if you are yet to get your Lazera license as a consultant, feel free to reach out to the group chat or to the number on the chat box. The cost is actually 5,000 Naira, but you can spread your payment for seven months, maybe 5,000 Naira every month, or if you want to pay it outright, it's fine. But we are saying that we, at one, we, want, to, um, we want all our consultants to be licensed so that they can proudly sell real estate and um, be a consultant with um, confidence. So that's so for anyone oh, who yeah. yet to get yet to get the license, please chat me up with your full name, your email address, and your phone number so that we can start processing it. For those of us who have um, paid before now, I'd like to tell you that you, your certification will be ready on or before two weeks' time. You'll get them ready. And we uh, hope to have them available at our next um, GBM meeting, which is next week Friday at um, Evidence Pace. So but if you are yet to get that or send your details, please do that as soon as possible. Yeah, hello, Chema. Just a quick one. All right, yeah. Yeah, quick one. I, I, I think the need for clear communication should not be overemphasized. Um, okay. If I recall quite well, you, what you told me and what you are saying now, it's a bit different. At the time I paid for that Lacera, you told me it will be ready by April. You are saying again, April, it's yes. Yes. Just a minute, so, just a minute. Yeah, so, okay. so my, my point is this. Can we have clear communication? So that, you know, because clear communications enhances trust. All right? And I do recall that I did ask this question on the PRC group um, since yesterday night. Nobody had deemed it me to respond. Again, this is my third or fourth time complaining. Messages are sent. And I really wish, you know, Mr. Sebastian was here and, or maybe the JP. Really no. When messages are sent, nobody has the time. Everybody's busy. We are all about doing something. Kindly do your best, whether you or whoever is directed, to provide responses within time. We are not doing, we are all working towards the progress of the company. Is it about investing or who are investing through me? Let's attend to questions. Let's respond. No matter how stupid it may appear to you, no matter how unclear it may appear to you, at the time, the person does not know. Answer. And it could just be what is needed to solve the problem. But this is another feedback I think personally you should take serious. And then let's have clear communication regarding this PRC. Because I must tell you from my own feedback and from one or two persons who are brought in, when they send you messages, you don't respond, you don't answer questions. And that is totally bad and unacceptable. And I don't think you should put up a defense. You should try and improve on this. Thank you so much. All right, thank you for your feedback. Thank you for your feedback. Actually, we actually we, we do respond to chats. Maybe maybe it was not seen. Even to now, I'm not seeing that very one you sent. But don't worry, we'll, we'll take that as feedback and um, improve on that. But as for the last round, please, I'd like you to also understand that we are not the one 
in custodian of that certificate is the Lagos State, and we don't have control over Lagos State. We can only tell you the date they give to us that it will be ready. So, on the real sense, that era takes one month for the um processing of which that was why we communicated April, and this is April. So, getting back to us, information reaching us just yesterday said that it will be ready in two weeks. So, I hope it's going to be ready in two weeks or not before two weeks. Time. That's why I'm communicating that now. So please um, bear with us. It's not our fault. It's just that the Lagos State government is the one processing the certification. For the certifications we are doing from our end, we don't take time in doing that. So if we tell you two weeks, we'll, we'll definitely work on that two weeks. But because these very certificates, I mean, license is not being processed from our own table. That's why we are very sorry for that. Hello? Hello, Mr. Sadia. Can you yeah. hear me? Please, this issue of Lastrada, I want a deep understanding about it because um, um, I'm mixing it with PRC. And uh, what, from what you are saying now, I'm getting a, a clearer picture about it. But um, the, is there any training to get the certificate or certain things one need to do to get the certificate? Because I'm thinking that PRC and Lastrada uh, certificate are the same. That's what I'm thinking. But now, I think the other guy that spoke is opening my eyes to one or two things, but I need a deeper understanding of what one will do to get a certificate. Is there any training? Is there any project? Is there anything you want to do towards getting that certificate? Please, I, I want you to shed more light on it. All right, so um, the PRC certificate is actually our own training from um, PRC. Okay. Yes, but for the last era, because of our um, partnership with the Lagos State Government, which um, uh, which um, they've been able to see us as an academy arm that trains consultants, they now yep. um, classify our own consultants. So um, yep. you're either going to the PRC training, but then the Lazara is just a line sense okay. for our consultants. Do you get it now? Yeah. So what which means that the PRC? The PRC. What do you the PRC? The PRC okay. Academy is licensed to train for Lacerera. So okay. once we train you in PRC, you are qualified okay. to get a Lacerera certificate. Okay. Yeah. So what are the things that I need to submit or I need to present to get the certificate? Is there anything that I need to get to get the certificate? Or money? Okay, of course, I'm aware of the 35,000, which I'm, as I, I'm sorting out one after the other. But at the same time, is there any other information you need from me to get the certificate? Or what and what I need to do to get the certificates, Miss Chaba? Please, you okay, can answer okay, so, that. Um, like I said, as long as you are a consultant with PRC, you yes. have license to get. You can get um, the Lazara license as okay. long as you're a consultant. So all what we need from you is your your full name. In fact, your details are already with us as a registered consultant. So okay. once you are interested, you just the file us. We pick up your details from the PRC. Um. Um. Uh, at our record of our parents and we sent to the government to process based okay. on your information. So all we need for you from you is just your full name, your email yeah. address, your phone oh. number, your passport and your ID card. Okay. So with that will help you process your license. Okay. So okay. all we need from all we need from you basically we've already collected it for your PROC. So okay. we just share that database with Lagos State. Okay. Yes. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Yeah, my name is Dari Akumi. Sorry, I joined the meeting late. Or the training late, rather. I have about two questions regarding um, uh, Palm Ridge Phase 5. Is it Phase 5? That's uh, the one for 750 per plot. Um, one of my clients was asking yesterday. Sorry? It's Phase 4. So now the question is, is it the one that is going to grow his food by himself or the asset rise is going to do that for him? And if he's going to do it alone by himself, how is he going to go about it? That's the uh, number one question. Number two question is agricultural uh, bova. That's the one for so for 450 early this year. Was it early this year last year? Um is it the asset rice that's going to grow food there as well, or the individual that bought the like can go there and start working on their lives? So these are the two questions I, I I know you might have discussed it earlier on, but because I joined the meeting late, that's why I'm asking this question. Sorry to take you back to the uh, question. Thank you. Okay. 
Hello, Mr. Gary. Hello, can you hear me? Sorry, I yes, lost I you at some point. Sorry, I lost you at some point. What I'm saying is, I asked question about the two um, uh, product of asset trades. That's the one in Ab Ado Ado Ota. Okay. Okay. So, Palm Ridge, I don't know, it's Palm Ridge Phase 4 or Phase 5, the one for 750 per plot. Uh, the for question is, yes, 750. As at yesterday, okay. that's the price. Mm. The, could the client that, ask that okay. is it the one that's going to grow the food by himself? That is the to plant on the land. Okay, that's or... for the bolivar. No, no, no. The one for some fifty. Is, is, is it bolivar? I said that one is palm. That's palm. That's palm fortune city phase two. Yes, palm fortune. Yeah, city. Yeah. Okay, so um, palm fortune phase two is actually a residential plot. But for now, we are saying that we want to plant for our customers and give them rental income annually. So we are planting for you. You don't have to bother about that. And we're giving you rental income, ten percent rental income on your land. Why would That's you for for development? Yes, please. So, but for the body oh, vibe, for the body vibe, the body okay. body vibe is actually a, an agricultural um, um, area. It's either you grow your food yourself or you contract asset rights to grow for you. But for us, we have um, we have a specific um, agricultural product that we do. Currently, we are we are actually doing the yam produce for now. So, but if you yes. want to grow any on any other products, you can you can go on them farm yourself if you have the idea. Okay, thank you so much. So, in a okay. nutshell, the seven fifty on the the uh, you are going to be the one to manage it while you give the client renter income on it. Yes. Is that yes. what you said about that? Yes, yes. All right. Yes. While the bulbard is rather you discover the company or the person to farm for you, for you, or you, or you go with yourself. Okay. Or you plant for yourself. All right. So, yes, okay. Yes, Thank yes, you so yes. much. And the last Thank question you. I want to ask. The last question: A client bought a uh, palm tree phase three. Ekbe. That was last day April. Last year, April, and um, he has paid everything. In fact, they've allocated the land to him. So now he's trying to sell. Do I also have reach out to? Do I reach out to customer here? He said, if I have a uh, uh, customer I want to buy, I should let the company know. Yeah, it's better. But I'm yes. trying to pray to open now. He can the company go for it, or I have to still look for someone to buy it. Okay, so so you would have to look for someone to buy. So um. We usually have a plan for those who want the company to buy a land from, his, from, from the customer. For example, the EDP, if you want to sell your land in a particular period of time, minimum of one year, we are guaranteeing you that you have 35% returns plus your capital. In that case, we are going to buy back the land. That's why we have EDP. If you're buying the land without EDP, it means that you want someone else to buy the land from you. That's uh, that means you sell it. Okay. That yes. means if the company is going to buy, uh, going through the route of uh, EDP. EDP, exactly, exactly. And, yeah, that means the the consultant won't benefit anything again, any longer. No. Or is it going no. to benefit? <laughs> no, no. Uh huh. And yeah. now, you know, getting getting a client to buy, we all know what Nigeria is saying at the moment. Even now that people are uh, trying to come back to invest. So getting a client, uh, what I mean is that it's easy. I don't want to use a negative word. Yes, yeah, yeah. But exactly. no, no, uh, but no problem. But if you, have, if you have a customer like that, you can um, set up a meeting with us and the customer, so we could discuss further. Oh, all right, all right, no problem. I will how, much that. It, how much is the person uh, selling it? Is it at the current rate or? Yeah, yeah. He, he, we check the current rate. I think the current rate and the statutory fee now everything is amounted to like three point five. Oh, which one? Right. Which 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 estate? Which, which of the estate, please? That's primary three. Let me check. Okay, I'm next. Uh, the the one in Epe. Currently selling for three point five, excluding statutory. No, we are selling for two point five. Two point five. That's the promo price. That's the promo price. Is it is it residential or palm tree? Is the palm tree? Okay, the palm tree phase three is currently selling for three point five million naira. Excluding you know, I didn't know that. <laughs> okay, how many okay. plots are there today? <laughs> I didn't get that. Don't worry, how many plots? How many selling? plots is the customer selling? It's only one that he bought. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, and he wants to sell it for 3.5, yeah? To collect the 3.5 back, yeah? Ah, 
That's what you want to collect, though. And the person that is bringing by, which I'm the one that is bringing it back to the company or to whoever they want to buy. I, I believe that me too. I need to get something, though. <laughs> okay, you know what? So the person wants to sell one plot okay. for 3.5 with the statutory charge, yeah? Yeah, I paid all the statutory everything. So you want 3.5 at the current rate, yeah? Everything 3.5. If you give us, we are ready to deal. Okay, don't worry. Maybe I'll chat to privately later. <laughs> all right, chat me. No problem. All right, thank you so much for your time. I'd like to appreciate everyone who have been on this call since 6 p.m. Value your time and um, we so much appreciate you. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. All information, all um, book chat, all info, all um, flyers will be sent to the group chat. Please stay tuned. And for those of us who are probably asking questions and maybe sometimes we are not intentionally ignored, please feel free to private chat or put a call through because we have so many questions about group chat that we definitely do answer. But uh, of course, sometimes we might not really capture them. But then, please, if if they seem to be very urgent and we are not seeing them, kindly put a call through. We are always available. We Thank are you. always available. Thank you for your time. Yeah. Really and I, I upload, sorry, I uploaded my payment receipt yesterday on PRC. Was it on Friday? I'm here to get my commission. It will be treated tomorrow, sir. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right. Good night, everyone. Thank you. Good night. Yes. Good night.